Hello everyone, warm good evening to all our esteemed guests and dignitaries on the dais. Uh, today it's a wonderful Sunday, uh, first week of July and first Sunday of July and we are here to talk about a very interesting topic on uh, integrating pharmacotherapy in tobacco cessation. Now I'm very happy to invite Dr. Reena Arkuma, she's academic director at ICANCARE to talk about the ICANCARE perspective of having this webinar. This is an amazing evening for me at ICANCARE and on behalf of ICANCARE, on behalf of Gujarat University, I extend a very warm welcome to each one of you here, because today what is happening is we in India, as Dr. Mohanan rightly said, are actually setting the pace. And what a right time, what a right time with this COVID there and all of us knowing that what is really happening. And uh, so rightly said by Dr. Mohanan that today is the right time that all of us together have jointly come together to set the pace. And as a focus team, because here we are looking at how can we make sure that there is an end game of tobacco which is there because there has to be a pharmacotherapy and as well as that a behavioral counseling involved in this but i welcome on behalf of i can care dr nimesh desai dr mishra dr rakesh raval dr mohan and dr swasti charan dr kalyan banerji and the entire team who's here our speakers our panelists who have made this so special for us Thank you for being here today. And we all agree, we all agree as a team that tobacco is the single most preventable cause of disease, disability and death in the world. It is a highly addictive substance. You know, look at what it's causing, the adverse effects on individual, the population level health. And just now, um, uh, what Shruti just said is about the NCDs. It imposes such a financial burden, which encompasses all the NCDs, the mental health, the premature deaths, developmental disability, huge losses, lost productivity costs, and of course, the direct medical care. At I Can Care, we understand the disastrous impact of this disease. We have a holistic approach. It's high tech and high touch. We believe that our job here is to save the youth. That's the new generation that we really need to save and work towards the tobacco endgame for individuals and the nation. We have taken a pledge towards that. We work by empowering and educate to evade and eradicate. We empower and educate the schools, educational institutions, public at large, influencers, corporates, social groups, health workers, and of course, our healthcare workers, our doctors, our strength over here. We evade and eradicate by saving the youth and evidence-based success of 92% in cessation and quit. We build capacity and capability because we create tobacco certified tobacco cessation specialists from Gujarat University by giving opportunity to skill up and scale up because this is something which requires that skill up and scale up. And it is not something which we have been all taught as rightly said by everybody here, all the uh, valued guests and speakers. But the question is that, are we doing that correctly? Are we really doing it correctly? Are we just thinking that we are doing it? Is it some kind of an excuse me for that? But is it some kind of a quackery which we are practicing when it comes to tobacco cessation? Or have we taken it all the way down the road and made sure that we have a cessation? And that is what at I can care. We are uh, uh, pledged to do that. We are to skill up and scale up with motivation and willingness and support because we know that without a national quit service line service, which I can care has a national quit line service and a digital mobile app for patients as well as doctors. So hence to say this, I think I loved what I'm going to close with because as Dr. Nimesh said it so well, it's the pizza base because we believe that this addiction that is there with, uh, we all know that has different aspects that it actually gets us. There's a psychological, there is a social, and of course there's an addiction part. So without integrating pharmacotherapy, we don't really have the pizza base. So let's all put it all everything that we have together and let's kind of work towards getting this on and the pizza base really working such that all the topping becomes the best. Thank you so much and welcome to everybody for being here today. Thank you, Shruti. Thank you so, thank you so much, ma'am. I think that was a wonderful address one more time. And uh, this again gives us a lot of confidence and a lot of uh, energy to really talk and take tobacco cessation ahead.